Hello all, welcome in this SAP tutorial. Today we are going to discuss how to create material master, how to change material master, display material master and if any mistake is there, how to delete material master. Okay. So for this, you need to execute the transaction code MM01. Okay. So once you create the, uh, click the MM01 you need to uh, fill the type of the material okay here you need to discuss the industry sector then material type okay then you need to click on the basic data okay then basic data to okay select simultaneously sales org data 1 sales org data 2 sales general plan data okay purchasing purchase order text okay these are the important field for various sap mm or fcp sd process quality management okay accounting one accounting two scroll mouse wheel down to bring the screen to desired okay enter is now processed right so you need to fill plan code you need to fill sloc code you need to fill a sales or organization and now this number will appear as a material master description sf6 cb 245 kv 3150 okay what is the unit of this material numbers right you need to identify the material group okay this is insulated type of the material group so we have maintained this okay and uh, here you need to click on the conditions okay so in the sales org one you need to fill the condition data uh, regarding the tax now you need to fill the item category group item category group is okay standard item that is normal item okay now availability check okay you need to maintain the data of availability tip check so here you need to maintain that no check right you need to fill the profit center you need to fill the profit center right if you want to maintain more details here you can material master creation for demonstration now next is plan data storage one okay here you need to fill the details inspection setup okay so you need to fill the inspection types okay we have maintained the good receipts inspection for purchase order okay now activate this and here you need to fill the inspection types and all the details there are so many options for this uh, here you need to fill the final inspections okay okay and click on the enter right valuation category you need to a text is enter in the field so you can pick from the drop down moving price is you need to maintain here 
moving price so moving price will be contained do you want to save your data for the material first yes i just want to save the data for the material first material this is created masses number this okay you need to note down this number generally field units field units are sending the data in the material uh, template form and at l2 or l3 level you need to create this material okay now again in accounting data one okay you need to fill the plant valuation class okay you need to valuation class here okay this is the transformer class okay and you need to fill the project stock valuation class so you need to fill this 5020 project transformer and you need to maintain depending on the your class you need to maintain the data here okay periodic unit price is this okay so this data has been maintained right now here okay in accounting 2 you need to maintain intermaterial extended to a different plant okay go in the basic data okay if you want to extend this material in multiple plant then you need to extend this material in multiple plant okay sales organization data one sales organization data two okay sales general plan data okay purchasing okay purchase order text there are various option you need to maintain here depending on your requirement okay and general plan data public storage too okay quality management accounting one accounting two the text is enter here we have filled the plan code here okay And uh, sales organization is uh, this okay so this is now we have created our material master successfully okay a text is enter here availability text is enter here in the field that is availability check that is kp okay and you need to fill the profit center okay you can choose from the drop down okay that is electricity transmission division okay so this is the way how you can proceed with this material master regard okay and here you can uh, go from any option from uh, the last icon okay so material master creation uh, important points are very important because once you created the material master that the same will be implemented in the field units for the different different procurement and sales activity okay we have maintained the data here okay inspection setup data okay and now we have set up the process successfully here right now so inspection setup is this and uh, you can set up the data the final inspections okay For example, if you want some uh, changes in the material master, then you can do the changes using MM02. Okay. If you want to display uh, the material master, in you can uh, display from MM03. Okay. So 
do you want to save for the material first yes okay so mm02 changes mm02 changes is very important mm02 for example i just want to change in the few details basic data one basic data two sales organization data two okay sales general plan data purchasing data and uh, international trade purchase order text okay so you can select these date these field and click on the enter that field will be editable and you can change in the uh, different different fields column okay and the same will be implemented as per your requirement right so you can fill the details likely and here you need to fill the plant again again the for example if you want to change the material group you can change the material group okay for example initially we have m00 m003 now we have maintained m002 okay the same you can change and mm06 flag material for deletion okay flag material for deletion so we have flagged this material from for deletion so we have successfully flagged this material for deletion you can check the same entry in mm03 okay in mm03 you can display this data so mm01 for creation mm02 for the ch any changes mm03 for the display mm06 for the deletion purpose right so this is the way how you can uh, correlate the data okay general plan data okay quality management accounting one accounting two and click on the enter once you click the enter most of the data will be displayed from here okay the deletion flag is set at the client level okay right so hope you understand this process whole okay and if you think that this is a useful tutorial for you then please subscribe our youtube channel for the same thank you and please share this knowledge with your colleagues and friends because sharing is gearing knowledge sharing is gearing and this tutorial is for prb understanding and uh, knowledge sharing purpose okay thank you have a good day see you in the next tutorial